Hey guys, let's fix SSD drive or a normal hard drive not showing up in Windows 10, 8 or 7 computer. Please follow all the steps mentioned and follow me. Let's get started. So press Window and R key on a keyboard or you can simply do a right click in the start button and click on run. And here type diskmgmt dot msc once you type it click on ok after clicking on ok there will be a disk management window and here we need to look for something which says unallocated now I have a SSD drive and I cannot format it but I'll show you in a website so here it should have any unallocated space so you just have to do a right click and then you just need to click on format just like that so currently I have C3 drives and it's a 300 SSD drive so once you see the unallocated drive and just do a right click and click on format make sure you are not formatting any uh, current hard drive which is already working because you might lose the data only the unallocated data and where you can see unallocated just here in the volume section alright so once it is formatted to NTFS file system then just do a right click and create a letter and how we can do that once you do a right click you just need to click on change drive letter and paths and it will look like this you can add and then assign a letter from here you can choose any different letter for that drive and then click on next so after this just click on start button and then go to computer or the browser like this you can click on the Windows Explorer and see the PC if it's showing you the drive or not if it doesn't we will move to the next step for that again we need to press window and R key together on a keyboard and this time we will type D E V M G M T dot M S C and hit enter a device manager window will appear and here we are looking for IDE I'll show you let me just maximize it for you guys since I have SSD drive so it will show me under disk drives so you just have to do a right click uninstall and restart the machine and if you're using a normal hard drive it will come under IDE so look for somewhere which says IDE and uninstall one by one and restart the machine and see if that's working for you or not and the third if it doesn't work make sure the hard drive is plugged in properly the cables are plugged in properly alright because uh, sometimes plugs are loose so make sure you just replug all the things there in the um, tower or in the laptop get it checked and still if it doesn't work you might have a faulty one alright let me know in the comment section and please hit the like button and subscribe I'll see you in the next video